What's going on YouTube? Hey, today we're going to do something different. I want to experiment with some stainless steel tubes. But I figured this time we're going to pack it tight. Mm. Well, as you saw in the last video, if you've seen it, the aluminum just melts right away. I'd imagine this won't melt nearly as easily. This one's got a tight hole at the end of it, so I'm kind of wondering if it's going to produce a jet. Otherwise, I think it'll produce some pretty interesting results. What are you thinking about? Oh, let's try and pack that down a bit. That's probably all I need. Yeah, I saw that coming. Apparently I did it. Well, uh, I'll go slowly. <laughs> well, I know what not to do. Brush things. Let's try that again. I gotta rinse them. Oh, it's all there. we go. See how deep that got in there? Oh boy. <laughs> I don't want to break. Well, yeah, alright, I need more. <laughs> as soon as I shove it in, it just wants to explode. I'm sorry. Oh. Well, I don't think I'll have this mess with thermite. Thing is, you didn't even let it in slowly. It's in my hair, isn't it? No, I did, but then it. The tape was a resistance and. Are you trying to be a ginger? Are you kidding me? Sort of. Well, yeah, it's it's all over on your. Oh. <laughs> Today's been a fantastic day. I'm covered in rust. Nothing like being a. Backyard scientist, right? Yeah, out the other end. Wow, just <laughs> poured out. I think that's it. Huh. Wow. And this is why I prefer a tripod. Well, as you saw it in the last one, it acted a lot like a jet. This time I got this entire tube filled up. So I'm gonna suspend it in the air and just see if it melts. There. Jeez, you're pointing it right at me. Oh, oh wait, never mind. Way. It's the other way. <laughs> I see this oh, shaft right there. It it's probably way. gonna spew out. Eventually I'm just gonna just gonna move over here. <laughs> Shoot, wait, wait. And recording. That's gonna shoot out, I'm sure. Well then, like I said, I don't know if this thing's going to build up pressure at some point and explode. Well, geez, I mean, well, it's not going to have an extra point like the other spot, but well, I think it's traveling. Oh yeah, it's traveling. I'm just surprised you're that close to it. Well, it just fizzles though. It doesn't actually make pressure. Well, if you think about it. Well, what if it seals itself on the other side? Yeah, but it's, it's just creating gases and you don't know, you know, look at that, it's traveling down the pipe. Well, you can see where the weak point is, if there... Well, it might just crumble, then we'll see what happens. Yeah, I think it lost oxygen, maybe. No, the, the, well, the iron oxide should be the oxygen. Oh. As long as the heat's there, it doesn't matter. I guess, side view. Yeah, it's getting rid of gases right I... now. Yeah, John, come this way. I don't know what to think of this. <laughs> ah, my eyes! Yeah, look, it's definitely going faster. Huh, it's getting brighter. Wow. Oh, is that, is that expanding? No, it's melting. It melting. I think it's melting, not expanding. <laughs> It's like it's like being all sneaky and uh, yeah, I know. I mean, from the inside, you like got said, this all, it has thing all going oxygen on. It needs. It's just reacting. Eventually, we're probably going to see it spit out that end. Uh, not very long. Oh boy! I think it's speeding up. Yeah, I think you're right. 
I might just melt into that aluminum. I'm hearing pops. I am too. No, it's not gonna melt into the aluminum, I think. Oh, yeah. watch that tape yeah, catch on out. fire. It's almost out. Is it gonna spew? Oh, jeez. <laughs> I'm not um, expecting anything. It's like... Hey, there might be a pool that's gonna come. Yeah, I think it might be a pool of molten stuff. And, well, that was a whole bunch of nothing. Maybe. <laughs> yeah. So what did you do? You, you oh, scarred look, the interior of a, a pipe, pretty much. I mean, that's some strong pipe, piping, or, I mean, steel, or what was it's it? It's dripping out right now. Can you see that? Huh. Huh. So I would assume now this thing is a solid piece of iron and steel. <laughs> hey, shoot uh, some water at it. Yeah, that's what I'm going to do right now. As long as it doesn't... Dang, that's got some weight to it now. <laughs> oh, it's more heavy? Oh, yeah. All that iron oxide melted, turned into iron inside this thing. Now I just want to open this thing up. You know what I mean? Huh. We have to find a way to do that. I don't know. Shouldn't be that hard. Might be more brittle. No. Maybe. All right, check this out. Basically, this thing's became a thing of rebar. This thing is full of aluminum and iron. I don't know what that equates in terms of steel. I know there's a whole bunch of different mixes to make steel. But anyways, hey, if you got any more cool ideas just like this, comment below, subscribe, and we'll see you later.